Your phone number feels private, but it's actually a key to a surprising amount of your personal information. Today, we'll show you how open source intelligence, OSINT, can turn those 10 digits into a detailed profile using only free public tools. We'll reveal just how much is out there and more importantly, how you can lock down your digital footprint. Let's get started. Let's dive into the world of data privacy and how seemingly harmless apps can inadvertently expose your personal information. First up is Truecaller. It's advertised as a caller ID and spam blocker. And while it does offer those features, it's also a massive crowdsourced phone directory. Think of it as a global phone book built by its users, for its users, but with potential privacy implications that many might not fully realize. When you or your friends install it, you often grant access to your contacts. This is where the crowdsourcing magic and the potential privacy concerns begin. By granting access, you're contributing to building a global database linking numbers to names. This database becomes incredibly comprehensive, spanning across countries and mobile networks. It's a powerful tool, but also a potential vulnerability. Enter a number into Truecaller and you might instantly see a name, photo, email address, or even a job title associated with that number. This convenience comes at the cost of potentially exposing your own information or the information of people in your contacts. This wealth of information is a goldmine for anyone looking to build a profile on an individual, whether for legitimate purposes or more concerningly, for malicious activities. Even if you yourself have never installed Truecaller, your number could still be in their system if someone else who has the app shared it from their contacts. This highlights the interconnected nature of our digital lives and how our data can be exposed even without our direct consent. Hackers and cyber criminals can use this readily available information as a starting point for more sophisticated attacks. They can then cross-reference the information found on Truecaller with details available on social media platforms and other online sources. The email address that Truecaller reveals can be used for targeted phishing attempts or to check if your email has been compromised in any known data breaches. This allows attackers to craft more convincing and personalized scams. Even seemingly innocuous carrier information, like whether you're with Verizon or T-Mobile, can be valuable to attackers and can help them with more advanced and targeted attacks, such as SIM swapping. The truly unsettling part is that you might be in the Truecaller database without ever knowing how your information got there or what it's being used for. So, what can you do to protect yourself? Your first privacy tip is to check your Truecaller profile and carefully limit what information is visible to the public. But even better, go directly to the Truecaller website and request to unlist your number entirely from their database. This is a more proactive approach to safeguarding your privacy. It's a simple but crucial step you can take to reclaim a degree of anonymity in an increasingly transparent digital world. Remember, in the world of data privacy, your phone number is often the first breadcrumb in a much bigger trail that can lead to your personal information being exposed. Don't let it be an easy entry point for those seeking to exploit your data. Take control of your data, be proactive about your privacy, and make informed choices about the apps you use and the permissions you grant. Next is NumLookup, which scrapes public records and data broker databases. Enter a number and you'll often get a name, line type, mobile, landline, VoIP, carrier, and general location. This helps confirm info from Truecaller and narrows down the search. Knowing the city or state makes finding social profiles much easier. Searches are anonymous. Targets never know they're being looked up. Hackers quietly assemble a dossier connecting each new data point. OSINT is about piecing together a private intelligence picture, one free search at a time. Your best defense? Limit where your number appears in public records. Stay vigilant about what's linked to your number. Sync.me specializes in linking phone numbers to social media profiles. Enter a number and you might see names, faces, job titles, and even public posts. This bridges your professional and personal life, linked in to Facebook, hobbies to workplaces. Even if your profiles are locked down, your number can still connect the dots. One overlooked setting can expose everything. Privacy tip. Check who can find you by your number on every platform. Don't let a single weak link compromise your entire digital identity. Sync.me shows how easily your worlds can collide. In the world of OSINT, even the simplest tools can become powerful reconnaissance assets. Spy Dialer, for instance, takes a rather clever approach to gathering information. It's a seemingly innocuous service, but its capabilities are quite revealing. At its core, it lets you hear someone's voicemail greeting without their phone ever ringing. The target remains completely unaware that you've initiated contact. 
It's a silent, almost invisible way to gather intel. This simple act confirms their name and voice, providing a crucial piece of the puzzle. Hearing the voice associated with a phone number adds a layer of verification that text alone cannot provide. And sometimes the voicemail reveals even more, like upcoming travel plans hinting at periods of absence or potential destinations. People often include details they wouldn't normally share in a text or email. Or it might reveal alternate contacts, family members, or business associates mentioned in the greeting. These connections can open up new avenues for investigation. The beauty of it is that it's stealthy. The target never knows you called, leaving no trace of your reconnaissance efforts. It's a ghost in the machine, gathering information without raising any alarms. Spy Dialer doesn't stop there. It can also pull addresses from public records, linking a physical location to the phone number. This allows for combining voice confirmation with location data, creating a more complete profile of the target. It's about layering information to build a clearer picture. In just a few clicks, a hacker can go from a seemingly random phone number to a name, a voice, and a physical address, all without the target's knowledge. This tool vividly demonstrates how OSINT is fundamentally about using multiple methods and data points, not just relying on readily available databases. It's about connecting the dots. Even a seemingly simple voicemail greeting can provide valuable new leads and insights. To protect yourself, it's wise to keep your voicemail greeting generic and impersonal, and crucially, don't reveal any personal information that could be used against you. Always be aware of how much you inadvertently share online and offline. Information can leak out even in places you least expect, so vigilance is key. Remember, in the world of OSINT, every detail matters. OSINT thrives on the accumulation of small clues, piecing them together to form a complete picture. Don't make it easy for those seeking to gather information about you. Stay alert and protect your personal information. The OSINT framework isn't just another search tool that you might find online. It's something far more comprehensive and strategically organized. Think of it as a meticulously curated directory. It's a master map, a central hub of all the tools and resources available for open source intelligence gathering. It provides a structured overview, guiding you through the vast landscape of OSINT possibilities. It organizes these resources into easily navigable categories, making it simple to find exactly what you need when you need it. The framework covers everything from specialized phone lookups and reverse image searches to in-depth social media investigations and domain name analysis. Investigators, cybersecurity professionals, and researchers use it to quickly find the best tool for any specific task or investigation. By providing a direct path to the right resources, it ends up saving hours, even days of potentially wasted research time. The OSINT framework is not static. It's constantly updated with the latest tools and techniques. It often features newly discovered or more obscure tools that you might not find through conventional search methods. The framework also helps you visualize and understand how seemingly disparate data points can be interconnected. It can reveal connections between phone numbers and email addresses or link usernames to physical addresses, uncovering hidden relationships and patterns. It's a valuable, free, and open resource for researchers, cybersecurity professionals, and ethical hackers looking to enhance their OSINT capabilities. However, it's important to acknowledge that this framework can also serve as a roadmap unfortunately, for malicious actors seeking to exploit vulnerabilities. Therefore, understanding what information is publicly accessible about you or your organization is the crucial first step. This understanding is essential to proactively protecting yourself and mitigating potential risks. Take some time to explore the framework and gain a clear understanding of your own digital footprint and potential exposure. Ultimately, awareness of your digital presence is your best defense against potential threats. Social Searcher scans the web and social media for any public mention of a phone number. It finds posts on forums, blogs, news sites, and more, sometimes years old. Discovering your number in a forgotten comment or a leaked document can be a wake-up call. Hackers use these mentions to build a historical profile and spot vulnerabilities. Never post your number publicly. Once it's out there, it's hard to erase. Social Searcher proves the internet never forgets. Guard your number like your password. Phone Infoga is a command line tool for deep phone number investigations. It checks validity, country, carrier, line type, and then scrapes social media, data breaches, and block lists. It automates what would take hours manually, compiling everything into a single report. Favored by cybersecurity pros, it can analyze many numbers at once. 
It's a leap from casual searching to professional-grade intelligence. With some technical skill, anyone can use it to uncover a detailed profile. The takeaway powerful tools are free and accessible. Don't underestimate what can be found. Facebook search and forgot password features can link your number to your profile even if you think you're private. If your settings allow, anyone with your number can find your account, see your photo, and get hints about your name. Even a private profile reveals a lot profile and cover photos, workplace, and sometimes your friends list. Hackers use this to map your social circle and craft convincing attacks. Privacy tip set. Who can look you up by your phone number? To only me. This closes a major gateway to your personal life. Don't leave this door open. Review your settings now. Data brokers like Bean Verified collect and sell massive amounts of personal info. Their free previews reveal if your number is tied to names, addresses, or social profiles, even if you don't pay for the full report. If nothing comes up, it might be a burner or privacy-focused number. These searches quickly show how deeply your number is embedded in public records. It's a sobering look at the data industry. Check if your number is listed and use their opt-out procedures if possible. The less data they have, the safer you are. Don't ignore your digital paper trail. Google Search is the most powerful OSINT tool, simple but incredibly effective. Search your number in quotes to find blogs, business listings, or resumes. Use advanced operators like FileType PDF or Site-PasteBin.com to uncover hidden mentions or data breaches. Google can link your number to your business, social profiles, or even leaked documents. Before using specialized tools, always start with a smart Google search. It's the foundation of digital investigation. The info you find can lead to deeper searches elsewhere. Never underestimate what a single search can reveal. We've shown how 10 free tools can turn your phone number into a detailed dossier. The real lesson, every data point is a thread. Pull one, and your whole digital life can unravel. Protect yourself. Treat your number as sensitive. Limit its visibility and lock down your privacy settings. Regularly review your accounts. Platforms change policies all the time. Remember, these tools are for education and self-protection only. Respect others' privacy and use your knowledge responsibly. Stay safe and take control of your digital footprint.